Hello everybody, my name is Katie and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am doing another bullet journal. This month's theme is going to be kind of like a geometric triangle type of theme. Um, I did find this online, I'll put the link to it in the description box below. But for this front title page, I just drew a bunch of, what are they called, triangles. And I colored them in different colors and drew different patterns on them. So the theme of this month is going to be like pinks and grays. So that's what it looks like. And then on the side, I wrote September um, on the side there to fill up the rest of that space. So moving on to the quote page for this month, since it's triangle themed, I said, be a triangle in a world filled with squares or filled of squares. Um, Cause it's gonna be unique. It's gonna be different. Uh, don't conform to what everybody else is doing. Be your own self. So that's a good important quote and it correlates with the theme. So moving on to the mood tracker. What I did for this one is just took the same triangle geometric piece that I drew in the front, but just erased everything in it. So basically just kept the bare backbone of it. I wrote the numbers inside each corresponding little space. And then I had like some extra, I needed more triangles basically. So I just drew some on the side to kind of look like they're falling off of the triangle geometric pattern. It's kind of hard to explain, you can see it better, but that's pretty much what I did. Moving on to the habit tracker now, just basically took my spread that I always use, took the geometric side or took the geometric portion, rotated that to fit, and then just filled in the numbers corresponding to the calendar. For my sleep tracker, did the same thing, just erased the last row because there's only 30 days in September. And for the highlight of the day, literally same exact thing. But since last month's theme was actually grayscale, all I had to do was change one of the alternating lines to be pink. So finally, for the weekly spreads, uh, all I did was I drew seven little different triangle patterns, orientation things. Um, you can kind of see what I'm talking about. And then just put that next to each day, put the numbers of that date next to each day, and then filled in the little extra space with any sort of triangle geometric patterns that I already drew. So once I got that beginning bulk part done, it was quite simple because I did a lot of copying and pasting of that same geometric design I drew, but I will say that design took a while. Anyways, here is the flip through. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I will post another video next Sunday. So I'll see you then. Bye.